Getting into Disneyland is like going through airport security. They don't allow aerosol sprays. They don't allow like so much stuff. I appreciate the fact that they're trying to keep everybody safe, but it's so extensive. They like body search you, like everything. You have to go through a metal detector. They had Grammy get out of her chair and stand up and like check her all down through. So I mean, you're, you're safe when you're in here. I'm in love with our shirts. It says, mine says, we'll trade husband for fast pass. He's got, we'll trade my twin for fast pass. We'll trade sisters for fast pass. You just got it. <laughs> we'll trade brothers for fast pass. We'll trade sisters, sisters for fast pass. His, of course, says, we'll trade my wife for fast pass. I should have changed mine to churros. For churros. <laughs> and hers says, we'll trade brothers for a fast pass. We bought these from actually someone who watches our videos. I'll have her shop link down below, but these are the cutest thing. And the size is like pretty true to size. So if you guys order one, it fit perfectly. So we're gonna take a picture really quick and then send it to her because it's the cutest thing. Let's see if we can get a picture this early. <laughs> We want bubbles? <laughs> bubbles? Uh -huh. Bubbles. My bubbles. My bubbles. <laughs> Just bribed all our kids with bubbles yeah. to take that. So, okay. Let's get him some bubbles. Get a fast pack. Yeah. Go on some rides. Hey, bro, don't you look at that. I said, my friend, what you looking at? I think she is something for me. Excuse me, miss. It's my first time here. Maybe you can show me out of here. I think she got something. her fake face they require that they wear a full face of makeup to be in the parade they request that she's back there five hours before she actually performs so we packed her a whole lunch we packed her some snacks we packed her water she's got her costume she's got everything to get ready the only thing that I need to do, do you know what my costume is I do know what your costume is, what is it's it? in your bag it's purple so we're literally just sat ourselves down in the middle of Disneyland and we're gonna get her some makeup we need to make sure this makeup stays on for the next five hours Normally we just need it, yeah. Normally we just need it to stay on for like a few hours because she just has her one little dance on stage. But this one, she's not even gonna perform for five hours, so it's gonna be quite some time. Close your eyes. Sorry. Lilia has two different events that she's doing in Disneyland. She's performing tomorrow on a stage, um, her competition dance that she did all season, but today she's actually performing in the Disneyland parade. Or I should say right before it. They're like the opening to the parade. So her, I, this is literally a DIY bippity boppity boutique. Accepting applications. So we're gonna get her makeup on and get her ready to go and then get her dropped off so we can all watch her. We just realized we forgot her earrings in the back of the hotel room. <sighs> Luckily, Amanda knows her way around this place, my cousin. Um, she's got annual passes and she knows where the hotel is, so she's gonna run back to the hotel, grab her earrings. I have everything but the earrings. I thought I was doing good here. So we're gonna keep getting her ready um, everywhere else and then we'll be ready. Off for her location. 
Christian and we did the same thing we did yesterday. We're taking the boys again on some of the faster fun stuff. Addie's just too small to go on the bigger stuff obviously and Lilia doesn't like it at all. But the boys like it. So this is actually working out in our favor. So we got fast passes for Matterhorn which is the big, big rock in the middle of Disneyland that everybody can see. It's that one right there. Not rock. That's a mountain. Okay. But you guys, Landon is tall enough to go on this now. Landon, let's see. He's officially over 42 inches. Landon, stand underneath right here. <laughs> Look at that. Boom, buddy. You want to go on it? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. We are the chosen one. Occasionally, they'll give you this little card to try to see how long the wait time is. So you hold it, you go through the line, and then once you get to the end of, or to the beginning of the line, then you give it to the person and then they chart. That's how they can tell you how long it's taking to go through these lines. We were the chosen one today. He was the chosen one. Don't forget, though, I always forget to give it to them when I get to the front, and then I'm like, shoot, I forgot. <laughs> We came back to the hotel and we changed our outfits. We had those shirts on that she gave us all morning, but wanted to change into our other outfits. We had some Mickey Mouse outfits and we're about to run. We came back to the hotel for a little bit to relax and then we realized that we have a fast pass for Star Tours in 10 minutes. So we're gonna try to get from our hotel. Oh wait, you can't go this way. We got this, we got this, Grammy. But they had, no, oh go that way, go that way. So Chris stayed back with Addy and Alina fell asleep. So he stayed back with a couple of, of well, the baby and one of the big kids because we woke up super early today and the rest of us are going to try to make it to our ride in 10 minutes so wish us luck mimi's favorite thing in the entire world is exercise so we're going to get exercise i think janelle has the rest of the kids up here gravy's faster than all of us can i hit your ride with you yeah <laughs> this way will they be able to get on like do they need your phone no they need my phone yeah but my shirt says mama mouse her shirt says mimi mouse and her shirt says Grammy mouse Chris had an outfit change too, so you guys will have to see his a little bit later. But the rest of the kids just changed into like Mickey Mouse stuff. We kind of overplanned and had an extra outfit, so if you're asking why we changed, that's kind of why. But their outfits from this morning were already all dirty anyway from all the snacks that they had, so it, it worked out. All right, back to making sure we get on this right. Let's go. They guys all, everyone needs to walk, please. And I was like, Okay, Got four, and then Grammy has one. <laughs> You're fast, right? Our fast pass ends at 1:35. It's 1:34. <laughs> we made it, guys. All right, we made it. Yeah. Yeah. He has an inhaler. <laughs> Insane. Something tells me we didn't even need a fast pass because Grammy just got us in the front of the line. No. Hey. But we did it. We know we could do it. We made it in one minute. High five. We did it, guys. Now our faces match our shirts, but we did it. Oh man, dude. We made it. Front row seating in the shade. 
that was important to us. Gabe's family is sitting right across from us, but Lily is on this side, but they have benches and stuff over there, so I think they're gonna stay over there, and I'm gonna stay over here, unless they decide to come over here, I don't know, but they do, they do have a really good spot over there, so I'll go check in, but she's technically on this side, so I think this might be a good spot. So let me grab some lunch. For the kids, they got some pizza going on. They got some breadsticks over here. I'm gonna call Chris in a minute and tell him to head back down here very soon. So we're gonna start gathering all of our people to watch my baby dance down Main Street. This kid has fallen asleep. Probably good because if he doesn't get sleep, he is mean. So. He was starting to have breakdowns. He's here for moral support that he's not consciously aware of. We're all waiting, all of us from here, down here, over to here is where we have over here. And then on this side over here, 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 I'm showing up, no you're good. All of Lilia's support. Down here, so many people. Woo, Lilia! I think there's like 30 plus people who are here. Yeah, just to support. Lilia, she's got a lot of family and friends and all that. You guys, I'm so excited. So we're at the end of the parade. The beginning of it starts in Small World and it's ending over on this side. So we're gonna see like the last, literally like the last couple times that they do the entire thing. So they're gonna be really tired by the time they get here. And it's, it's pretty hot. Literally learned one little portion of the dance and they do that same portion of the dance I think they said about 15 times over and over and over and over again. And it's like a travel dance that they learn throughout the entire like park that they do it. So it's so cool. And then that's the start of the Sound Stational Parade, which is their like midday parade that they have here in Disneyland. And I just got goosebumps hearing the song. Disneyland is proud to present a Sound Stational guest performance. Please join us in welcoming yeah. Dance yeah. the Magic with the uh, Diamond Dance Classic. Yeah. Amazing. Amazing. 
Did you have fun? Yeah. Brother, finally got to see you. Your brother slept through it all. What? This, this brother. Not that your, one. Your baby brother. <laughs> boys anywhere and we have a feeling that they might be in this place but we just don't know interesting it's really weird and then this fell this is on the ground no put it back oh i don't know where it goes we're leveling out all of the sugar and cotton candy and lollipops with some fresh fruit so once in a while. Okay, you all had to correct me, didn't you? But I need to tell you something. What? Never eat sugar, okay? Kids? Okay, kids. You just winked at me. But here's one fun fact for you guys. It's not discounted. They don't take your, your season pass discount when it's healthy stuff. I got a discount on the candy. Yeah, discount on the candy, not on the watermelon. Plan accordingly. About a good time. We're chasing every moment all the good nights. We're always looking out and it's a good dinner I think and then we're gonna watch Fantastic and then we're gonna go to sleep because Lily has to be up first thing tomorrow for her other dance performance but we have a dilemma we've lost Mimi again in the same exact spot that we lost her yesterday which is right in front of Pirates of the Caribbean the spot is cursed you guys we lost Mimi again you know where Mimi is we let me lose the kids but she's just she gets a little overwhelmed in these situations she's not much of a people big part kind of person is that her do you find her Oh, wait, we found her. We found her. Wait, wait, wait. We have kids in between. I need to stop. Mom, we lost you again in the same spot. Good. Good girl. You learned. Good. Okay, apparently she was with one adult. I was like, no, this is the same spot we lost you yesterday. We're two. No, but I did say I'm getting PTSD seeing the little flashlight people. Okay, <laughs> right, do we have all the kids? We need, we need to do a head count. I have five. One, two, three, four, five. Six. We're missing some. Seven and um, eight, Kaden. That's it. Cool. We're good. Okay, we're good. Can't they just DoorDash food to the Fantasmic line? <laughs> Can that be a thing? We just sat down for the Fantasmic show. I've got my own personal hairdresser back here. She did her hair great. So I'm sure she's going to do a great job with mine. Say, what's up, fam? <laughs> but look at this view we have right here. We're sitting for Fantasmic. Literally, the show happens right, if it'll ever focus. Oh, hi, Kaisen. The show is right there. That's where Mickey Mouse is going to be standing. But the kids are starting to drop like flies. We're starting to lose them. They've had, we've been awake since six. It's been a long day. So they're powering through it. Like, not much complaining. They're doing really, really good. I'd rather them do this silently than, like, be, you know, crying and, like, throwing a fit. So I don't know how many of them are gonna actually make it to the show. Probably, uh, hopefully when the music starts. Let's make bets on Kyson. Yeah, Kyson's gonna be 100% not gonna make it. Look at him, he's rubbing his eyes. The walk back to the hotel is gonna be fun. Oh, dude, no. Oh, he turned to his side, that, it's know, done. What? Alina too, Alina's done too. And she napped today. This one's going strong though. Going. She's still going. Hi, crazy. Are you ready to watch the show? Yes. Yeah. <gasps> Let's see the show. We now invite you to join Mickey and experience Fantasmic, a journey beyond I think Tommy wants wildest to get imagination. Here we go, guys.
woke up real quick when that show started. We made it through, we have such a big group, but I can't feel like, I can't get everybody in the shot. I feel like sometimes we get some of the kids more than the other kids, but we're all spread out over here. Now, those are some good seats. Do you guys like it? Yeah. We, we just left Disneyland and we're going through an exit backstage because I think because the castle shut down, I don't know why. But they opened up some like backstage exit. We're going to <laughs> oh, look at this bathroom. This is where we're in the cast filming thing. But my battery's gonna die. We're literally like in a secret pathway right now going through. We went all the way around Main Street instead of going through Main Street to get out of the park. They brought us this way because it's so crowded. This is so cool. We're like back to, oh, look, and now we're going back into the park, I think. This is so cool. Ah, oh, my battery's gonna die though. Thank you so much for watching. So we'll see you guys tomorrow in another day of Disney.